My name is Father Bartholomew Agar, and I was one time organist here at the Abbey, and I would like to share with you some of the most beautiful sounds we have in this instrument. And I'd like to begin with the, what we call the great organ. And there are a row of stops on this side here that control the keyboard. And the great organ is this middle keyboard. And when you, I just played on it a minute ago, but I'll give you a little a repeat of that marvelous sound. I'm pushing buttons under here, which are called pistons, and they change the stops automatically for you. I'll be doing that once in a while, so don't get scared if things popping around. And here is the great organ and some power. Inside of all that sound, there's some individual stops. And one of my favorites is probably the only part of the organ that is made out of wood. All the other pipes are made out of metal. And it is this beautiful flute. Listen to this. Just as a solo. <laughs> And that leads into another stop, which I like to think of as a French horn. So that's it. If you're a French horn player, you'll like that one. And in a chord. Those are some of the ideas that you can get from playing on the middle keyboard. Now, we're going to move down to the lowest keyboard, which is the quietest part of the organ. Again, that most beautiful stop in the great organ. Now we're going to go to the lower keyboard right here, and the stops for that are very, very delicate, like this. Almost, as Father Mike likes to say, it's angelic. And you're going to hear him use it in some of the music that he's going to be playing in a few minutes. But do you notice how quiet that is? It's almost invisible but it can be brought up louder. And to put that flute I just played for you on the grate along with it, listen to this. Together. Isn't that wonderful? There are a couple of other stops in the choir organ, that's the third keyboard, that are just beautiful by themselves. And here is a four-foot flute and it is absolutely exquisite and with a little tremolo in there and an instrument if you're a clarinet player you probably have heard this sound before That's a reed, and we're going to talk about that in our next segment, where we go now to the top keyboard called the swell. notice I have changed to the top keyboard. This is called the swell. And it's called that because, as I believe, you can alter the loudness and softness of it. And I don't know whether you can notice, I'm going to hold a chord and you can see if it gets louder. You have an idea of how this works. See how you can disappear. That's why it's called a swell. Now the wonderful thing about the swell organ, that's the least stops over here, is that 
they add color to the organ. And one of the things that they do, they can make it sound like an orchestra or a band or whatever. For example, you can get this wonderful sound of a trumpet. You have a trumpet and you have a oboe. And its big brother, the bassoon. Basso profundo. But to make it really come alive, you have to have an orchestra has strings in it. And so the organ builder tries his best to imitate it. You have to use a little imagination, but here's a string organ. And if you do a little ledger domain, I'm going to bring in the organ's idea of the human voice. And if you use your imagination, you can almost hear a heavenly choir, the Vox Humana. That is the fourth keyboard on our instrument, and it's, uh, uh, people think it's the hardest thing to play, but it really isn't, to learn how to play with your feet and the hands at the same time, another feet. Anyway, I like to hear you, we're doing sounds in the, of this organ. Down in that lower level, you just heard some of the uh, high-pitched uh, sounds it makes. But of course, it really is the bottom end of the keyboard, the bass, like the bass fiddle in the orchestra. And it gets even lower. And at that point, I'm going to play some, a few chords for you up in the upper range, uh, ranges of the instrument, and the great organ, because it has a lot of power. And listen, when you put this pedal in with the organ keyboard itself, talk about grandeur. As you listen to the sound die away very slowly. Well, that, my friends, is the Abbey organ. But I'd like to leave you with a little bit of fun. We have a large set of pipes at the far end of the church, at the west end, called the Trumpet Premontre. And it is a noble sound, to say the least. At this end of the church, almost 200 feet away, we have a matching set of trumpets and elsewhere we have a third set of trumpets and I'm going to play make up a little ditty for you and I'm going to wind up with a surprise so here is some diddling 
among the three nice big trumpets in this church. And let's start out with the big brother at the far end of the church. <laughs> can talk to his brother up here. And another little brother sounds like this. And then there is a big brother in the pedal. And our little surprise 